Antaro Adun, Executor. I am Judicator Aldaris. I have been sent by the Conclave to serve and counsel you. The former Executor, Tassadar, was commanded to halt the Zerg progress in the Terran Sector by burning the infested human worlds. Unfortunately, he disregarded his orders and attempted to destroy the Zerg while sparing the Terrans from the flame. Clearly, Tassadar has failed us. You must not. The Conclave has dictated that our first priority is to strengthen our defenses. You must reinforce our outpost in Antioch and make certain that the province does not fall to the Zerg. Your old comrade, Praetor Phoenix, will meet you there and assist you in this endeavor. Receiving. Input command. Confirm. G. Alison. Gaugola. Receiving. I long for combat. Honor guide me. She saw to make use of me. What now calls? Kalagos. I long for combat. Initiate. I long for combat. G. Alison's protocols. I long for combat. Honor guide me. I long for combat. 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 I I I Ah, Executor, and Taro Adun, it is good to see you once more upon the field of battle. I hunger for battle. What now? What would you ask of me? What would you ask of me? I hunger for battle, as you will, for ire. Executor, the warriors have engaged the enemy. Intended to construct photon cannons here for defense, but without thrones, we could not do so. Immediately! What would you ask of me? As you will! For hire! Knock the sock! What would you ask of me? I'm 
for ire. Immediately, for ire. As you will. Immediately, as you will. Immediately. You know it, Sekitor. Although we two have marched across hundreds of worlds together, I never imagined that we would be fighting on ire. The Zerg are indeed worthy foes. Antaro Adun, Executor. Your defense of Antioch has restored my faith in the Templar caste. I admit the Tassadar's desertion had shaken my faith. Indeed, Algaris. I would hope that the Judicator would put more faith in their Templar brethren. Tassadar, where have you Be been? Be silent, Judicator. There is no time to waste. I have much to tell you. As you know, the Zerg vanished after the fall of the Terran world of Tarsonis. And though the Conclave bid me return home, I was compelled to remain. A powerful psionic call drew my attention to a remote barren world named Char. Apparently the call was answered by others as well. For upon Char, I encountered those who were once our brethren. The Dark Templar. Consorting with the Fallen Ones is heresy! Enough! Hear me, Executor. For I have learned much from the Dark Templar prelate, Zeratul. The Overmind controls its minions through agents called Cerebrates. Strike down the Cerebrates, and the swarms will surely fall. Executor, Tassadar may be right. If you can keep the Zerg occupied, my force may be able to penetrate their perimeter and slay the Abomination. I pray we can trust you, Tassadar. Already I can sense the taint of the Fallen One's influence on your mind. You must return to Ire at once. My concern is for the safety of Ire, not the judgments of the Conclave. I will return when the time is right. <laughs> Make use of me. To come. Do not. Do Come 
I will remain behind and observe the effects of our attack. Return to the Citadel. I shall notify you when the brood becomes erratic. Executor, I bring news most dire. The Cerebrate that we thought we had killed has arisen again. The creature's battered form was reincarnated despite the considerable damage we inflicted upon it. Even now, the Cerebrate drives its brood in preparation for their next offensive. It is as I feared. It was folly to believe Tassadar could be trusted. The Conclave will not soon forget his wanton betrayal. Nevertheless, we must stand resolute, for attacking defenseless Cerebrates is not the way of true Protoss warriors. We shall overcome the entire swarm with the might and the fury that is our heritage. Executor, we shall lead our main strike force to the province of Sion, which has fallen to the Zerg. It's time the Zerg felt the wrath of the Sons of Ayr. Prayer to Phoenix will remain here with a small detachment and guard Antioch from any further assaults. Adun be with you, Executor. Bring swift death to the enemies of Ayr. <laughs> Oh, 
nostrils. I long for combat. Your nostrils is for two.
Patience. Overwhelming Zerg forces. Praetor, you must hold your position for as long as possible. Fight on, brave Phoenix, and know that the gods watch over you. Entaro Adun. Executor, I know that you were reluctant to leave Ire in this dark hour, and that you still grieve for the loss of your comrade, Phoenix. But remember that he lived and died as a Templar. He has reached the Kala's end. There is no greater glory than that. We Judicator are called to look beyond such matters, to ensure the safety and future of our people. It is not the Zerg but the rogue Tassadar, who represents the greatest threat to us now. 
If he is allowed to spread the Dark Templar's tainted influence to Ayer, all will be lost. We will find him and bring him to judgment. Tassadar claimed that this world was abandoned by the Zerg just prior to the invasion of Ayer. Yet I still sense a lingering darkness here. Be prepared for anything, Executor. If there are still Zerg on this world, then they must surely know of our arrival. I long for combat to your thoughts. I long for combat to the I have come to arrest you and bring you home to Aya to stand trial. Arrest me? Aya burns at the touch of the Zerg. You travel all this way to arrest me? Don't let it get to you, man. This happened to me once. Who is this human, Tassadar? The name's Jim Rayner, pal. And I won't be talked down to by anybody. Not even a Protoss. Amusing. Tassadar, your taste in companions grows ever more inexplicable. Executor, prepare to take Tassadar into Executor, custody. Executor, wait. I do not know what they have told you about me. But what I have done, I have done for Ire. Help me find Zeratul and his Dark Templar. They alone can defeat the Overmind Cererits. Once we have won, I shall gladly submit myself to the judgment of the Conclave. Unthinkable. You presume that we would side with the Dark Ones as you have? You have gone quite mad, Tassadar. You shall speak of them with respect, Eldarus. Executor, there is much that I can explain to you. If only you'll help me find Zeratul. This should be good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, may I help? Go 
lost ones. This is Jimmy. Mr. Will, make I hear you. Rainer here. How may I help? Rainer here. I hear you. Of course. It shall be done. For Adun, Tarakala. This is Jimmy. I hear you. It shall be done. Of course. I hear you. Make use of me. How may I Anytime help you? Anytime you're ready. I hear you. I heed thy call. Stop. Serach. Stop. Anytime you're ready. I hear you. Go ahead, Commander. Right on. This should be. Under attack. You have my thanks, Executor. Now let us find Zeratul and speed our way home. Executor, by following Tassadar and attempting to rescue the Dark Templar, you have openly defied the will of the Conclave. Abandon this mad scheme now, and the Conclave may show you mercy. Don't let him control you, Executor. The Judicator have long since steered the actions of the Templar to their own ends. It's time we acted of our own accord. Ah, Tassadar. Have you fallen so far? To think that you were our brightest hope, our most beloved son. Now you are everything that we are not. You are lost to us. Not only have you damned yourself, but you have damned those who have followed you. Such is the price for our race's salvation, Judicator. I have been here with the Dark Templar these last few months. While I helped them in their fight against the Zerg, I learned many of their secrets from the Prelate, Zeratul. Apparently, the energies which empower the Dark Templar also course through the Overmind and its Cerebrates. The same Cerebrates which you told us to destroy. Your advice was useless, for the creature was reincarnated before our eyes. Unfortunately, yes. Your attack on the Cerebrate failed because the energies that you wield are useless when used directly against the Overmind and its Cerebrates. Only the Dark Templar's power can truly harm the Zerg. That is why we must rescue Zeratul and return him to Ire. You were warned, Executor. The Conclave will not be pleased. Your will, it shall be done.
Hey, Sergeant! Sarge! Hey! You will immediately tell me why you have called me from my desk, Private! Protoss unit, Sarge! Coming through the South Pass! It looks broke! Kill it! Zeratul and his brethren are close by, but I have been unable to make contact with them. I fear they may be in grave danger. We must scour this area immediately and find the Dark Templar, lest they be overcome by the Zerg. How may I help? Yes, I hear I them. long for combat. How may I help? For a boon. Yes, I long for combat. Yes, Jacked up and good to go. Twenty ten of the heat. 
slamming. Let's go. I love you. Get him in the Jacked up and good to go. Yes. It's all. Yes. Oh, man. Get him in the Jacked up and good to go. Jacked up and good to go. I hear you. Let's go. How may I help? I'm a tenor of the heat. Fire it out. Slam it. Good to go. One turn of the heat. Give me something to shoot. Yes. Jacked up and good to go. Yes. Give me something to shoot. Let's hit it back. Give me something to shoot. Give me something to shoot. The warriors have engaged the enemy. For a position. It shall be done. Tony Kalal! Greetings, Dark One. I have come to bring you home. Greetings to you, mighty Tazadar. I knew that you would not forsake us. For in the time that you have spent with us, you have learned to value our ways and our methods. You have learned to channel our dark power as well as that of your masters. And thus you alone have found completeness beyond the scope of the Kala. But, I fear that the Conclave, in its pride, could never bring itself to welcome outcasts such as we. Outcasts though you may be, it is your vision and courage that may yet save our homeworld from the swarm. I beg of you, Zeratul, return with us to Ayr. Though they are petty, and have in ignorance cursed your kind for generations, help me save our people. Since our banishment long ago, we have never failed in our responsibility to Ayur. Though it shall cause us great pain to see our homeland once more, we shall return with you, Tassadar. We will do what we can. I am overjoyed to see you both return home in this dark hour. The Zerg have redoubled their efforts, and it Phoenix. seems... It can't be. The Executor told me of how you fell before the Zerg. How is it that you live and breathe? <laughs> well, after my unfortunate defeat, my ruined body was recovered by our brethren. I now reside within the cold robotic shell of a Dragoon. Old friend. Would that this never came to pass. Nonsense! There is no shame in defeat, so long as the spirit is unconquered, and I am still able to serve Aya to a degree. But enough of this. There is much you both need to know. You have been branded as traitors by Alderis and the Conclave. Even now they seek to arrest you and execute the Dark Templar, Zeratul. I never believed that they would go so far. In the face of total annihilation, they still cling to their failing traditions. Yes, and that makes them all the more dangerous. They hunt you even now, Tassadar. And though I damn myself by doing so, I shall stand by you till the end. In Taro Noble Phoenix. Executor, it seems that if our world is to live, we must protect the Dark Templar from our own brethren. Although it pains me greatly, not even the Conclave shall stand in our way. Executor, you and the traitor Tassadar are to cease your resistance and surrender yourselves to the judgment of the Conclave. We will take the outlaw Zeratul into custody and deal with him as is written by the Kala's law. Flee back to your masters, Aldaris, and huddle with them in darkness. For your actions shall set us all unto the Zerg. The warriors have engaged the enemy. Yes, Executor. For a tournament. Cast Naraka. Set us your orders, Templar. Cast Naraka. You 
They are undisputed us for generations. And now you beg us to aid you? We will do what we must. But we do it for Io, not you. So be it. It will be done. So be it. It will be done. And Taro Adun, I do this for you. And Taro Adun, it will be done. So be it. I do this for ire. So be it. I do this for ire. And Taro Adun, I do this for ire. It will be done. And Taro Adun, I do this for ire. It will be done. Executor, Eldaris, this madness must stop. The sight of my brethren slaughtering one another is more than I can stand. Though I fear you would doom us all, Alderis, I surrender myself to the Conclave. End Taro Adun, Executor! Don't give up the fight! Tassadar of the Templar, by your actions you have severed yourself from the mercy of your brethren. You refuse to destroy the Terran worlds as was commanded. You have questioned time and time again the sacred will of the Conclave, and you have abandoned your home world in its darkest hour. Most grievous of all is that you have allied yourself with the blasphemous Dark Ones and learn to utilize their profane powers in tandem with our own. What say you, O fallen Templar? Eldaris, I submit myself to the Conclave's judgment. But know this, given the same choices again, I would surely have made them. I have sacrificed all that our world might live. I have sullied my honor. I have discarded my rank and standing. I have even broken our most ancient traditions. But never think that I would for one moment regret my actions. For I am Templar, and above all else, I have sworn to protect our homeworld till the end. <laughs> Taro Adun, Executor. All seems lost now, but still we must fight on. We must find Tassadar and secure his release from the Judicator before they can execute him for treason. Without him, I fear there is no way to defeat the Zerg and their Overmind. Zeratul and his Dark Templar have vanished, leaving us to fend for ourselves. I wonder if Tassadar was mistaken to have put his trust in them. We are receiving a transmission from Captain Rayner's command ship. This is Rayner. I'd like to help if I can. Tassadar laid it on the line for me and my crew on Char. I'd like to repay the debt. Besides, I'm a long way from home, surrounded by hostile aliens. I've got to do something. Then you shall, bold human. You shall. <laughs> What now, Gauze? What do you 
instructions. This is Jimmy. Your command. Thank <laughs> you. 
Instructions. Your class. 
is absolute. Make peace with Adun. Stay thy hand, Adjudicator. The stewards of Tassadar shall not fall while the Dark Templar live. Call off your guards and stand aside, and you may yet live to see another moonrise. I will not be addressed so by one so devoid of the Kala's light. You and your vile brethren shall die with these traitors. Are you truly so blinded by your vaunted religion that you cannot see the fall ahead of you? Your conclave believes that they are winning this war, but all they have succeeded in doing is helping the Overmind to win. What could you possibly know about our designs, Blasphemer? You speak of knowledge, Judicator. You speak of experience. I have journeyed through the darkness between the most distant stars. I have beheld the births of negative sounds and borne witness to the entropy of entire realities. Unto my experience, Alderis, all that you have built here on Iora is but a fleeting dream. A dream from which your precious conclave shall awaken finding themselves drowned in a greater nightmare. We shall see. Executor, my gratitude to you for having secured my release knows no bounds. By all the gods, we may win yet. The time has come to let loose the fury of the Dark Templar. Zeratul, perhaps the time has come to tell our friends of the foe we face. Indeed. When I slew the Cerebrit Onchar, I touched briefly with the essence of the Overmind. In that instant, my mind was filled with its thoughts. And I tell you now, our worst fears have come true. The Zerg were indeed created by the ancient Zelnaga, the same beings that empowered us in our infancy. But the Overmind grew beyond their constraints and has at last come to finish the experiments they began so long ago. So you see, my friends, we fight not only to save Ire, but all creation. 
If we fall to the Zerg, then the Overmind will run rampant throughout the stars, consuming all sentience, all life. It is up to us to put an end to this madness, once and for all. Our forces shall engage the primary Zerg Hive Clusters in an attempt to weaken their defenses. Once their numbers have thinned out, Zeratul and his companions can infiltrate the Clusters and assassinate the Cerebrates. Adun willing, the Cerebrates' deaths will distract the Overmind long enough for us to assault it directly. You address me. Your orders. It will be done. I hunt you for battle. I hunger for battle. We are vigilant. Jack us all. So be it. It will be done. Your command? I hunger for battle. What would you ask of me? I hunger for battle. I fear no pain. For the Kala is my strength. I fear not death, for our strength is eternal. Awaiting instructions. Input command. Receiving. Awaiting instructions. Unauthorized transmission. Incorrect protocol. Drop your weapon you have 15 seconds to comply. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I long for combat. She house is our suit. What now calls Entaru Adun? All for the Empire, doomed to all who threaten the home world, is our doom. Transmit. We are vigilant. You address me. What now calls is our doom. I hunger for the truth. Is our doom. You've got enough minerals. Executive Ross. Additional pylons. You must construct additional pylons. Ross. Galadun, we feel your presence. We are vigilant. We sense a soul in search of answers. Thank you. 
Hunters have engaged the enemy.
instructions. You have not enough minerals. You have not enough minerals. You have not enough minerals.
Should we fail here? We seek now to destroy a foe that has ravaged its way across the universe, consuming all in its path. And now, it has reached the end of its long journey. The Overmind has come to destroy all that we hold dear, and assimilate us into itself. And I say to thee, this shall not come to pass. Fire shall not fall! Executor! I stand ready. As do I. Well, I guess all I have left is to see this through. The Zerg have taken everything from me. My home, my family, my friends. I know that nothing I do can bring those things back. But I'll be damned if I just sit on my hands and wait for the end. I want a piece of them, all right. I'm in. Then let our actions speak for us. For Adun! For Ayr! Executor, Tassadar, this comes too late to you. But the Conclave has witnessed your defeat of the Cerebrate. They know now that they cannot deny the necessity or the valiancy of your actions. We sought to punish you, while it was we who were in error. You represent what is greatest in us all. And all our hopes go with you. Antaro Adun, brave sons of ire. Wow. Does that mean they're gonna send some backup for us? You have not enough minerals. SCP, good to go, sir. You got my attention. Slamming. Your orders, Templar. SCP, good to go, sir. Orders received. Jacked up and good to go. Standing by. Anytime you're ready. SCP, good to go, sir. Yes. Slamming. <laughs> Wanna turn up the heat? Slam it! Yes, sir? Orders count! Not enough minerals! SCP, 
good to go, sir. It will be done. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. SCP, good to go, sir.
Upgrade complete. Upgrade complete. Your warrior has arrived. The enemy. Your orders, Templar. Your command. 
My courier has arrived. I hear you. Your command? Affirmative. Yes, Executor. You Your will? Carrier has arrived. Instructions. I hear you. You know? You are with us? You know? How may I help? You know? Will? Your command? Yes, Executor. Instructions. I hear you. You know? I hear you. You are with us? Yes, Executor. Instructions. Your command? I hear you. Instructions. For Adun. You know? Yes, Executor. You know? You are working on us, Executor? You know? Your command? Yes, Executor. You know? Your will? Your command? Oh, yeah.